Meet Armando. He sublets this awesome second floor apartment from a subletter's subletter. He plays tandem tennis with three colleagues every Sunday morning. Armando uses his every spare minute at home, tending to the hair on his stuff. Yes, he has hair on his sneakers, his Boris Dragunov tennis racket, even on his balls. It started at a young age for Armando. He noticed the difference in the seventh grade. Mom, I have hair on my stuff. After a long match, the men have a beer at the local pub. All the pretty girls there, they love this group of lads. And yet the only thing poor Armando goes home with is his hairy trophy. Every Saturday, Ferguson drives to his favorite wallpaper shop and buys three rolls of the exact same wallpaper. Thank you, Mr. Ferguson. Helsinki Charcoal 2FC. Ferguson then routinely applies these fresh sheets to his apartment walls. You see, Ferguson too has hair growing all over his stuff. Newly sprouted tufts are hidden by habitually reshuffled furniture. Ferguson will always insist that this is for good feng shui. Benton and Margalina met in a corner bookstore one sunny Sunday afternoon. Benton knew he was in love when Margalina politely touched the hair and moved his man satchel out of the way to get closer to the diagrams on page 34. On Independence Day, the couple moved in together. Margalina and feels right at home. She doesn't mind that almost all of his stuff is covered in hair. Even the book that brought them together now sits on the mantle, covered in hair. Although she loves him dearly, Margalina sometimes fantasizes about what it would be like if he didn't have so much hair on his stuff. <laughs> 